Hi everyone! Today we're going to be doing the 10 month baby and postpartum update. So just keep watching. Hi guys, welcome back to Super Wendy Time. And like I said, today we're going to be doing the 10 month baby and postpartum update. I am just so glad we're finally doing this video because he turned 10 months February 28th. If you're interested in videos like these, like baby videos, mommy videos, organizing videos, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell for updates on new videos. So yeah, let's jump right into the video and watch to the end for bloopers because let me tell you there's a lot in these so all right let's get started first of all let's go with the development so so yeah this month what we did was we had to baby proof everything we got him a gate and we still need to get another gate and possibly the, the doorknob thing because he is already trying to reach the front door knob from that side and from the gate to the kitchen, he he reaches like the um, the stove turning thing. So that is not good. You still get more baby proof stuff. But yeah, he's over there, chilling, chilling like a villain. He stands up on his own. Like if you're on the bed or like on the floor, he stands up for a little longer. So I'll show you a clip of that. Right? He got sick on the 25th of February. So. That delayed this video being made and uploaded on time so um he was just not in the mood and then i got sick the following week so then i was in the mood of and i couldn't, i didn't have a voice so like i couldn't film so that's why we're doing it so late he got he knows like he pulls from me and gets up or just from the couch he gets up he's like i said still very alert from sound movements he said mama i have it on film he was like mama 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 he loves FaceTiming my mom. He just loves it. Even when someone calls me, he's like looking at the phone to see where their face is. So he tries to like high five. He points his finger. If you saw in the beginning, he points his finger. I answered a clip of when um, I was practicing Zumba and he was behind me dancing. That was so cute. Loves, loves to play. Like if I would just sit there and play with him, he would be in heaven. I, I try to make time in the morning and the evening to just sit, sit with him on the floor sit with him in the floor and play he gets off the couch and the bed by himself like he literally just like sort of grabs onto the um, um the comforter and just turns around and flop his feet on the floor he can sit in the grocery cart um little seat and uh, like any restaurant seat which is kind of cool so if he's awake he can just be there and just playing with whatever or actually eating on like the day of valentine's day there was like a party at church and uh, we had to go and decorate and we accidentally matched without even planning it so i'll insert a video of that he loves to be chased like if if you're behind him and you're just like chasing him he loves going away and something he is really smart about if he has like let's say he finds a little I don't know, a piece of tape or like string or something on the floor or something he shouldn't have put in his mouth and he puts it in his mouth or he has it in his hand and he knows we're coming, he runs. He runs. He knows he's not supposed to have that. When we do laundry and we're like folding in the living room, he just loves getting in the laundry bins and getting everything uh, unfolded. He also walks more. I don't know if I put the last, the last one, but with the walker that you hold and push, um, he, he can do that really fast. Goes up the stairs at my aunt's house like super fast. Like he's like ready to go up those stairs. So one time we, he fell. He was like two steps up and and he and, I, and he heard me and turned around and fell back. So we had to put like this divider thing so he wouldn't go up. So that's that's it for the development. Really amazing. Um, yeah, he loves talking. He thinks he's talking, which is cute. He is still breastfeeding. Um. A lot. Not as much as before, but he's breastfeeding. And he eats snacks here and there, foods here and there, but like he won't finish a whole plate if I serve him. So it's just a little bit. He just eats a little bit. He's not picky at all. Like if he sees me eating, he wants to eat it too. 
He's sleeping in his crib during naps. He still doesn't sleep through the whole night, which is so embarrassing. And I'm done with him waking me up at night. But we are working on it. Um, the bad thing is that he is used to falling asleep while he's eating. So when he wakes up, he thinks he should still keep eating. Um, so we'll see if uh, his dad can help me out when he wakes up, which is really rare. Because he wakes up like... 12 a.m. or 2 p.m. 2 a.m. when we're sleeping, so we'll see what happens. His weight, I believe he's 23 pounds and 6 ounces, but I'll insert it here if there's any different, um, yeah. And I'll insert the length as well, because I'm not sure what his length is. Diaper size, he's still size 4, probably really soon he'll be size 5, but um, he just has those thick thighs and legs, so. Clothing size, he is 12 to 18. Uh, months but more towards the 18 and up because yeah it's a big boy and that is it for him so now for me postpartum update I believe I'm still 130 maybe 133 the goal is still to get to 120 sleeping I sleep around six to eight hours which is not bad at all I'm active every day like there's it's really rare when I just sit down and do nothing I'm always like what else do I need to do I think he touched the light bulb <laughs> But yeah, so, so I can finish this video. Um, so yeah, I've been organizing the whole house, like every inch of the house. So far I've done the kitchen, um, Axel's nursery, my closet, the hallway closets, the linen closet, the pantry, under the sink. Right now we're working on the living room, uh, especially because he's grabbing everything. We have to take everything that's reachable and put it up high or put it away for now. Um, so I've been really busy with that. But yeah, I've been using the Happy Planner and it's just really fun and cool to use the stickers. And, and I've been meal prepping, so that's really convenient. But yeah, that is it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you enjoyed it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Yeah, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to be your best, look your best, and feel your best. Until next time. Bye, guys. See you next month. Until next time. Bye. Watch the bloopers. Boing. 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 Bye, guys. Look. Look. Bum 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 Hi! And then hit the notification bell. Yeah baby, you tell them. Every little corner. Oh, oh he just pooped. Right? Oh! You touched the light bulb, didn't you? Oh, this little finger. Mwah! Sana, sana, correcta, rana. Como dice, mañana sale la algo así. Mañana sale. Mañana. Bye. No. Don't do that. Not for Axel.